hello guys welcome to another video of forming salt in the room so in previous episode we managed to break up from Seljuks and destroy their mighty empire and now we are looking for a good opportunity to declare war on byzantine and as you know we need the seven duchy in byzantine to form the sultan of rome okay guys i managed to get some powerful allies and now i'm ready to declare war on byzantine because byzantine is in mess byzantine is fighting a claiming war let me show you as you can see so this is the best time to declare war on byzantine and take that duchy let's call my ally in right now i'm just searching this and waiting for my allies to come okay it seems the emperor of byzantine has been changed but my goal is still the same so let's see how they are not that strong they are even weaker than previous emperor okay guys now that i got architect i think i'm gonna switch up to the entry because i'm gonna murder a lot and i need some of these perks so i'm gonna focus on entry for now hello there and it seems Byzantines are coming for me so I'm gonna send my troops there and I don't know where are my allies my allies are coming but I think I can win this far without them okay we need to replenish our supplies look at the Byzantine they don't have any men at arms we easily can destroy them okay it seems again the Emperor of Byzantine has been changed but my cool is still the same of course uh, look at their strength they are really weak okay guys i will go for them because they are sieging this and i don't want that and here we go they're not gonna send their troops in this is not byzantine troops so i will not get any benefit any war score from uh, killing them so i'm not gonna kill them okay guys i forgot about that because i'm sadistic i can murder my children so i'm gonna do that i'm gonna murder this little one here we go and I will gain stress for inviting people because I'm paranoid which is really sucks I really hate this trait why my ally is there my ally is not coming to help me I think we're gonna lose this without my allies that is really sucks that is a close battle but I think I'm gonna win yeah we're gonna win Look at my allies, they don't care really. Okay, I will spend some money to murder my child. Let's do that. And here we go. And here we go, 100% war score or let's enforce our defense. And boom, we got this touchy. I really like to revoke this title, but I don't have a good current authority. But I'm gonna increase my current authority right now. Here we go, and I'm gonna revoke this title. So right now I'm just gonna increase control in this county and promote culture on this county as well. Let's try to murder the Byzantine Emperor because I wanted to be able to declare war on Byzantine again let's do that guys i will improve my court food not only because it will give us a small boost to our health but it will give us 40 percent stress loss as well which is pretty good i'm gonna do that here we go and i will improve this one as well because it will give us more prestige and i really need prestige so yeah let's do that oh i have another son that is really sucks i might just murder my wife because she doesn't have a Great is that and she only giving me son which is really sucks okay here we go 25 person only no that is really sucks I don't know what's happened to that I'm gonna wait okay 42 person to kill this guy let's try our chance and here we go he died and now there is this little child on the throne and I'm gonna declare on him for this touchy of course and I will start another major scheme for my son 
let's do that okay my wife just died which is really good and now I'm gonna find a new wife and I really don't need any more child so I'm gonna choose this one and it seems this woman is pretty good this woman is good as well I'm gonna choose this woman okay 95% to kill my child but I will go in depth which is really sucks here we go okay guys after a long sieging progress we managed to win this war I didn't fight a single battle but we managed to win this war and get this duchy which is really good and now this dude is my vassal so I'm gonna demand conversion let's do that okay he will accept but I need to pay him some coins which is okay I'm gonna do that guys because I'm sadistic when I'm gonna execute someone I will lose some stress which is really good I'm gonna do that here we go and this one as well and this guy as well yeah let's do that that is really good Bruh. it seems some of my scheme has been discovered and I need to cancel this I spent a lot of money on this scheme so this is really sucks so now I think we only need to wait to declare war on Byzantine again because as you can see because my Allah Mah has 43 learning it will only take two years until he convert face on this county which is really good okay guys we have a cool thing here we have a jihad and I really didn't seen this before because I didn't play it a lot as a Muslim ruler and for now I will not pledge but we'll see about that and it seems we're gonna fight against our allies which is kind of funny he is my brother-in-law guys you know what I'm gonna pledge military support because it's gonna be fun so let's do that I really don't wanna raise my whole army here that is probably enough okay guys here we are let's go in we managed to win a big battle here I will destroy this they are here they are sieging this so let's try to catch them and fight them okay I will go in I hope these guys come in as well come on yeah here we go come on you cowards oh my god that is really sucks that is really sucks okay I didn't expect that this idiots just didn't help me okay guys we are going for this a big battle here here we go oh my god look at our ad advantage that was pretty good guys why AI is so stupid where are we going right now guys you know what I'm gonna disband my army it doesn't worth it we are fighting over four years in this war and it's still no progress and AI is playing just really stupid so I'm not gonna involve myself anymore okay guys let's just declare war on Byzantine this time I'm gonna use holy war for duchy and for this duchy of course let's do that of course I cannot call this ally because I'm fighting against him in this holy war so I'm gonna choose this ally okay guys Byzantine is sieging this so let's try to catch them here we go and it seems we lost this battle which is really sucks we had a lot more casualties oh my stupid allies came and they just got wrecked I'm gonna torture some of my prisoners and lose some stress let's try to catch Byzantine yeah here we go okay guys we managed to siege this three castle here now I'm gonna fight Byzantine again they came back to siege at this two castle here guys just look at AI he's acting so stupid here just look at him <laughs> that is perfect are you 
stupid or something. I'm gonna catch Byzantine here. Nice. And after winning this battle, it should pop up to 100%. Yeah, here we go. Let's enforce our demands and we have this duchy for ourselves. I'm gonna give this two county to my player heir and I will give this two county to my third son. Let's do that. And I will disinherit my third son. It will cost a lot of prestige, but it's okay. And I might just murder my second son, I don't know. And it seems somehow we are in war with these guys because they have a claim on this county. So I'm gonna call my ally in because it's a defensive war. It will not cost any prestige, which is really good. Guys, I think I'm gonna white piece this because it really doesn't matter if they have a claim on this county. So I'm gonna white piece this. I can win this easily, but we have some claiming faction here. We have some independent faction here. So I'm gonna deal with this guys right now. Here we go. Okay guys, here we go. They are only levies, so that's not gonna be a problem for me. I'm gonna win. Here we go, only with one war, with one battle, we managed to win this war, which is kind of funny. And I'm gonna imprison all of these guys. Guys, as you can see, we have three of the seven duchy for forming the Sultan of Rome, and I have a good plan for this four remaining duchy. And now somehow we are winning this war, which is kind of funny. It's been over nine years. I might just send some troops here to help. Okay guys, I'm gonna start a murder scheme against the Byzantine Emperor. Let's do that. And let's invite some people. Okay guys, 95% to kill this guy. Let's see, and here we go. Just like that. Okay guys, now I'm gonna declare on Byzantine. I'm gonna invade kingdom. And I'm gonna invade this kingdom. Just keep it in mind that you can only invade one kingdom per life. So let's declare one Byzantine. That was a really brutal battle. We managed to win this one, but Look at our loss, just we lost too many soldiers. And I will get some mercenaries to help us in this war. Because I have a lot of money, why not? Oh, it seems my son died somehow. That is really sucks. Okay guys, it seems Byzantine is fighting somewhere else and they are busy with these guys for a claiming war. That is really good for us. Now we can siege these castles without being worried about Byzantine. Okay guys, after a long sieging progress, we managed to win this war. And let's enforce our demands and get this big part of the Byzantine Empire. Here we go. As you can see, we got some vassals and they don't like us, but we got so many counties right now and I'm gonna give away all of them. And as you can see now, we can form the Sultan of Rome, but the problem is we are in war. I really don't know when this war will be over. It's just really annoying. But I will wait for now. Okay guys, I give away most of these counties and I created some duchies. And I keep this four county for myself and I give away some of these counties here because some of these counties has a really good building so I decided to keep these ones and give away these ones here. Guys as you can see this duchy here is split a realm into the two so I'm gonna declare on this lady holy form for this duchy. Let's do that. Okay guys, we managed to win this war. Let's enforce our demands and here we go. And now that's looking so much better. Guys, we have a huge independent faction, which is kind of a scare, but considering that they are only levies, so that couldn't be that bad. But again, they are a lot, so it's not gonna be easy either. 
Okay, here we go. Let's see how big they are. Um, they are not that big. Okay, we can defeat them. Okay, it seems finally we managed to win that big holy war. That is really good. And now I'm just gonna finish my war. Then we're gonna create Sultan in the Rome. Here we go. And 100% war score. That is great. And I'm gonna torture the peasant leader because if you torture the peasant leader before enforcing your demands, you will gain 15 direct, which is really good. I'm gonna do that. And now I'm gonna enforce our demands. Here we go. And finally, the decision is available to form the Sultanate of Rome. Here we go. Let's do that. And here we go, the new Rome. With the conquest of the rich lands of Asia Minor, I have accumulated enough power to form new Sultanate. One that is sure to top the greatness of Rome itself. There is still work to be done, yet I have no doubt historian will enshrine this moment as one of the greatest steps in the conquest of Europe by the followers of Allah. Yeah, here we go. Holy shit, that looks really good, I'm not gonna lie. And this is how it looks right now, that's really good. But I mean, what is point of doing this without conquering the great Constantinople? So, I'm gonna murder this child really quickly and then we will declare war on Byzantine for Constantinople. Let's do that. Okay, here we go, 95% to kill this child. And here we go, easy. Okay guys, let's declare war on Byzantine for this county Constantinople let's find that okay here we go let's declare on Byzantine guys look at this we have no need to trade and everyone are just terrified by us I love this sadistic trade okay guys I see this tier county because I want to make sure we have supplies to take Constantinople and now let's see Constantinople itself it will take three years until we siege Constantinople which is really sucks Guys, now I can assault the fort and it will take only 41 day until we conquer the Constantinople. So I'm gonna do that. No, 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 never mind. We are losing too many men. Okay, guys, here we go. We managed to siege Constantinople and we managed to win this war. Let's enforce our demands. Here we go. We have Constantinople. That is pretty good. And I'm gonna move my capital here and increase control on this county and promote culture and of course convert face in this county as well. Okay guys, I think that's it. I really enjoyed this campaign myself. I hope you guys did enjoy it as well. So if you did, please do me a favor and smash that like and subscribe button. It's free. You can always change your mind later. Take care of yourself and I will see you in next one.